everybody. This is Christine. I just finished making my very first loaded envelope, so I want to show you what I did. There are lots of tutorials on YouTube on how to make the actual envelope, so you can do a search if you're interested in making one of these. So this is the envelope that I made. It's quite packed and I'll take you through the embellishments. I tried to make this, um, the little items in there, as functional as possible so that this could be given to someone as a gift, even if they're not a paper crafter. So let me just take you through these. On the back, I'll start with the back. I made it with the Graphic 45 paper collection and so I put a beautiful image of a lady here and then I put some wedding applique on here and I layered a flower. This is fabric and paper and I put a button in the center. I did put a ribbon it threw some eyelets on the back so that it could be hung up. Now this has a special surprise in it. I put a mini album so I wouldn't hang it up with the mini album in it because it can be quite, uh, quite heavy. So here I put some little acrylic embellishments and on the side I reinforced the side with an extra strip of cardstock and I covered it up with this pretty black ribbon so I think in my next one I might actually make it a little bit thicker to accommodate everything this measures an inch across so I might go an inch and a half now here on the front at the bottom I have this little flower again that I assembled with a little button center. It is a little ribbon rose and some little dangling pearls. Some more wedding applique. And this is a little mini purse. I saw a tutorial somewhere on how to make these. And it was just a little purse like that with the punch and you fold your paper. And what I decided to do is to make it more functional. So I put a little magnet inside to keep it closed and this opens like that and you can write a note on the inside. And I just tuck that in here. You could also write a little note on here. Now because this is so thick I don't think I'll be putting everything back in on video. Now here I've got some tags. Now this paper collection is all about special occasions and celebrating. So I made these tags, happy anniversary, it's party time, let's party, and congratulations graduate. And these can be attached to gifts and there's room for a little note on the back. I include this, this little paper clip that I made and I've got little danglies on there. This was part of an earring and I attached some ribbon on there. And in this pocket I have another tag and you can put photos on the back. And I've got this little center, a flat back pearl center and some little acrylic beads around there. This paper is hard to see, but it is a bit shiny. And on this layer, I made a bookmark and I attached beads on there with a little chain and I've got an eyelet. And this is from the paper collection. And here's my pencil. I wanted to include a wand, but I wanted it to be functional, and I'm including a notepad in there too, and you can record memories, so you just sharpen the pencil, you can still use the eraser, like that. And I've got some little ribbons attached. And I made a notepad using the paper collection on the top, I've got some little pearls on there, and there's a little notepad. I wanted it to blend in with the papers in the loaded envelope. Now these 
are envelopes. They're just plain black envelopes with this room for a name on there and I'll show you in a few minutes why these are included. And here is my mini album. I've got a flower here, I've got two straps with a magnet and again I used Graphic 45 Paper Collection. I'll include the name of the collection in the description of this video. I can't remember what it is offhand. So this opens. There's lots of room for photos in here. You can put a photo here and here. And I didn't embellish because I wanted it to fit inside the loaded envelope. But you can also, whoever receives this can also just put on their own embellishments. Photo there, there, here. And this is accordion size style. And then it opens on this side. Like that. And this is what those envelopes go with. I made some greeting cards. It's a little belly band that's supposed to hold them together. But once you take these out, the belly band will fit. You can stuff the envelopes in there too. So I'll just remove this. So I took again some of the images because this paper collection is about celebrating. I've got one for wedding, little note card, and each of the cards is lined with paper so you can write a little note on there. And here's a happy birthday. Congratulations on your new baby and time to celebrate. So there's my loaded envelope. Oh, and I also included these little things here. They're not very functional, but they are decorative. And I just slide those in the pocket like that. But I hope you like it and that it gives you ideas for your own envelopes. Bye.